Hey guys, welcome back to my video. Today we're back at Downtown Disney for an update video. I haven't done one of these, I feel like, in like two weeks. So I'm really glad to be back here and I can't wait to see everything that's new. I've already spotted one new thing. Well, it's not entirely new, it's been out for like a couple days now, but it's actually right behind me, right there. I'm gonna show you guys. So what I was gonna show you guys is actually people taking pictures in front of me right now. So I wanna show you guys the old ESPN building, which looks like it's now the new Disney Plus building. <laughs> Look at all these banners and graphics on the windows it's all disney plus content it's pretty cool and it looks like they're advertising disney plus day which i believe is this friday the same day as the start of christmas time over here at the disneyland resort i don't know about you guys but one show that i really cannot wait to see is the book of boba fett super excited for that one Looks like it's gonna be streaming on December 29th. I'm I'm literally counting down the days. <laughs> but anyways, it looks like they've changed the mural over here. This is at the start of Downtown Disney. If you were entering to the symbol outside, and it looks gorgeous. Look at that. Love the castle. That's actually how it kind of looks right now too. It's got the wreath, the garland, I like the snowman, the toy drummers. Goofy looks like he's having a good time. <laughs> This is awesome. Oh, you even have a little bit of Cars Land back there too. And it looks like they changed all the banners as well and all the light poles. And now they're themed to Christmas time. Even this banner that says Magic is here has a bunch of snowflakes on there. <laughs> and it says celebrate the holidays November 12th to January 9th. And then over here across from Jazz Kitchen, looks like they brought back a booth from, I don't think they had it last year, but I think they had it two years ago. But the Iceland Workshop, which is an entire booth dedicated to just ornaments. They're not entirely open, but you can catch a little glimpse right there of all the ornaments. And it looks like they even do personalizations here too. That's pretty awesome. So I think we're gonna check back over here around like 10 to see if it opens or not today. Uh, that's usually around the time when I have stores here in downtown Disney open, but we'll see, hopefully. Uh, another thing I wanted to mention is I'm kind of disappointed that the pumpkins are still here. I wish they would be like Christmas trees already or, or Christmas themed or something, but they still just have pumpkins. But then again, Disney moves really fast, so all this could change overnight. Like I could post this video today and by tomorrow it'd be Christmas trees. <laughs> but anyways, now we're gonna head to World of Disney and see if they have any new merch. All right guys, we just got into World of Disney and I think we're gonna start over here in the new emo section. So it looks like they also got in the 50th collection for the new emos. This is all for Walt Disney World. Whoa, check this out. This is also from WDW. Got Mickey Mouse on there. I kind of like this. $12.99 for that one. Then they got this one in black and yellow. It's pretty cool. $12.99 for that one as well. Then looks like they also got the holiday collection in. I might end up buying this one just because of how cool it is. And then here's the rest of the collection. These don't look that festive, but that one, that one for sure does. <laughs> and in case you guys are wondering, these are $12.99. So it looks like they restocked the popcorn ears. These are the ones that were made by Loungefly. They're supposedly scented, but I don't know. I've never had luck getting any of the popcorn smell on these. <laughs> but if you guys are looking for these, these are $39.99. Check out this Minnie Mouse Nutcracker. For a second, I thought it was Mickey, but if you read down there, it says Minnie. That's so cool. Let's check out the back. Looks like this one is $59.99. Looks like she's holding a pair of ice skates. <laughs> and on the bottom says, you make me melt. And it looks like they got this new musical figurine. Look at that. All the characters are putting up the tree, decorating it. This one retails for $74.99. And let me go and show you guys how it looks out of the box. They actually have it right here on display. It looks really nice, I like the colors. And then they also have this one with Jack. It looks like they also have that light up necklace, the snow wand, they have the Mickey magnet. And then here's something I've never seen before. They have this hair accessory, what's well, a, it's a bow, but it lights up. Let's see if I can find the button. There you go, that's awesome. This one retails for $16.99. Wow, that's an expensive bow. Wow, check out this cookie jar. It says Chippendales, 
Got Mickey and Minnie at the door. <laughs> oh, look at Chip and Dale. They're in the stockings. Goofy's building a snowman. Looks like he's upside down, though. <laughs> oh, you got Daisy in the window. And you got Donald and Pluto over here. That's awesome. This one retails for $54.99. So I showed you guys the Minnie Mouse Nutcracker. And then here's a look at the Mickey Mouse one, which I think they sold out because there was no more on the floor. But here's how he looks. And then on the bottom it says, Ski you real soon. <laughs> looks like they also got in this pretty cool train set. Look at that. It's all themed to Christmas. Season's greetings from Walt's Holiday Lodge. This is awesome. This is I think this is way better than last year's. And then in case you guys are wondering, this one is $149.99. Oh, check these out. It's a Chippendale mug set. So you can get it with one hand. Look at that. These mugs are pretty big. So you can get both of these for looks like $39.99. And then it looks like they got the salt and pepper shaker set as well as the holiday baking set. And then for you lounge party lovers, check this out. They got the new Christmas one in. This one has all the, the Disney treats all over it. This one's nice. Let's see the price on this one. This one retails for $75. Let's go ahead and check out the lining inside. There's a look at the lining. It's pretty cool. It's simple. I didn't expect it to be black, <laughs> but it's still cool. This is definitely the year of spirit jerseys. So they have this new red one. It's, it looks a little darker in person than it does on camera. It looks a little lighter on camera. This one's $74.99. And then on the back, it just says Disneyland Resort. It's pretty simple. I really like this one. But sadly, as always, they don't have my size. <laughs> they go from extra small to 2X. Also, in case you were wondering, they do come in kid sizes. So they do have that same red spirit jersey in kid sizes. Looks like they have extra small to an XL in kid sizes. And it retails for $49.99. Wow, look at this green spirit jersey. This one's awesome. Super soft. Look at that. Man, this is something you wear at home and just cuddle up in your bed or something. <laughs> and then here's a look at the back. So much glitter on there. Look at that. I think that kind of ruins it for me. I'm not a big fan of the glitter. But I love the emerald green on there. It's really nice. And in case you guys are wondering, this one's $84.99. And then as far as sizes, it looks like they only have medium right now. And then it looks like we have our first pair of Christmas ears. They're Mickey Mouse sugar cookies with Santa hats on them. <laughs> kind of cool. These retail for, looks like $29.99. And you guys know like this this uh this gingerbread cookie look that Chewbacca has this year? He has it on this shirt, the socks. Well now he's also on a lounge fly bag. Check that out. That is so cool. <laughs> I'm definitely gonna pick one either for my wife because uh she, she's a big fan of this look. And it is a lounge fly, like I mentioned. Check that out. It's a tiny crossbody bag, but Still really cool. This one retails for $70. If you guys are looking for these, make sure you guys grab it as soon as you guys see it because they're very popular. This was completely full and now there's only technically two left because I'm taking this one. All right guys, so our next stop, instead of World of Disney is gonna be the Star Wars section because they have two new Star Wars lounge flies here. Technically there's three new Star Wars lounge fly bags today, but here's two that I haven't shown you guys yet. So they have this one, it's a hip pack. And it's got the Mandalorian and the child. Let's look at the back. And on the strap it says, wherever I go, he goes. That's so cool. I'm going to show you guys a look at the lining inside. It's pretty cool. Looks like camo almost. And in case you guys are wondering, this hip pack is $55. All right, so here's the third Star Wars Last Five bag of the day. This one is cool. I think this is probably my favorite one, and then the Chewbacca bag, and then the hip pack. But look at all the characters on there, and I like how these like little straps right here are like iridescent. Look at that. Really awesome. This bag retails for $75, and let me go and show you guys the lining inside. Uh, there's nothing special inside, it's just black, like space. 
But like I said, this is probably my favorite last fly of the day. It's really pretty. And you got the little iridescent strap right there. Or little strips. Really nice. Speaking of iridescent, World of Disney actually dropped a new iridescent line here. Let me go and show you guys. So it's not the full line just yet. I believe there's a pair of ears that go with this collection. But for now, they do have a couple of long sleeve tees, which are pretty cool. Ooh, look at that. It's nice. This one is for kids. This one retails for $29.99. And then here's the adult version. It says Disneyland on the sleeve. And this one retails for $39.99. And then here's the woman's shirt. Look at all that sparkle. <laughs> uh, $39.99 for that one. And then they have this long sleeve shirt. Look at that. Got the castle on the sleeve. And then it says Disneyland. So cool. This one retails for $54.99. So I think our next store is going to be Marston's Confectionery. Let's go and see what kind of treats they have today. So when you first walk into Marston's Confectionery, they have this little holiday set up over here. They have the apron. They have this new tin. I haven't seen this before. Let's see what it is. This one. Oh, it's the peppermint bark. This one retails for $17.99. And then they also have the chocolate bars too. They always have one every year, a new set. So this one has dark chocolate peppermint crunch, milk chocolate, dark chocolate sea salt milk chocolate marshmallow and eggnog flavored candy bar huh this one retails for $14.99 and then it looks like they have that mickey serving tray and then the hot cocos here's a look at their treat display they have that pumpkin spice uh, toffee here they have the chocolate fudge they have the chocolate dipped marshmallow ones they have the Minnie mouse apple they have the apple pie apple, which recently made a comeback. They have the caramel peanut apple, the fully covered caramel apple. <laughs> they have the three new holiday cupcakes. Delicious. They have the Minnie Mouse cake pop, Rice Krispie treats. They have a bunch of cookies down here. They have the gingerbread one, the sugar cookie, and then they have that chocolate chip cookie. Well, that's a look at their current treat lineup. Still no cake pops. I usually look forward to the cake pops, but nothing yet. I don't know if you guys can hear that loud noise <laughs> in the background, but that's actually uh, work being done over here at the new stores coming to Downtown Disney, which is Paley Soccer and Love Pop. Here's how it currently looks over here. Man, they did such a good job on the display over here at the home store. It looks so good. I think we might go inside. See what they have. So it looks like they have basically everything we've already seen in the past, except for this. They have a musical tree. I haven't seen this yet. That's so cool. Oh, this game's mini got stuck because of the box. But in case you guys are interested in this, it's $39.99. If you guys are looking for Halloween merch, the home store also has you covered. They have all this left over. I don't think I've ever seen these before. Check out these shot glasses. I mean, toothpick holders. <laughs> $9.99. And you got the castle on the back. That's awesome. And then they have tons and tons and tons of ornaments here. And then they have even more over here. Alright guys, so we ended up leaving the home store. They didn't have that many new things in there, so we ended up leaving. But, we're walking past Tortilla Joe's, and it looks like that ornament store is open. So here's a look at some of the ornaments you can actually buy. They don't look Disney related, but... They're definitely Christmas related. <laughs> I like this one with the marshmallows and the hot cocoa. Or all the turtles getting the Christmas tree ready. And then they have all of these as well. And then just to get an idea of like what the prices are, Let's see if we can see how much this one is. Doesn't say. 
So I ended up buying Edna uh, an ornament. I got her that one of the nurses hat because she is an LVN. So I decided to get her that one and I'm going to get her name uh, written on there. They're actually working on it right now. So I'll show you guys once they're done. So it took like two minutes <laughs> and we finally got our, our ornament back. And I just had them write Edna on there. Uh, they asked if I wanted to put the year and I was like, nah, we'll just, you know, that way we can reuse it for other years. Because if we put 2001, then it's kind of locked into 2001 in my opinion. But it says world's greatest nurse. It's got her name on there. And this was, I think, after taxes, like 22 and change. So it's not too bad, but at that price, I'd rather just get a Disney ornament. <laughs> but Sally, they don't have uh, like nurse ornaments, so that's why I, I ended up buying this one for her. So I hope she likes it. All right, guys, but anyways, we have one more store to hit, and that's Star Wars Trading Post. So looks like they've already started doing Toys for Tots. So if you guys want to come and donate a toy, they only accept new unwrapped toys. Whoa, look at this Han Solo action figure. That's cool. The power of the force. This one retails for $29.99. And look, it gives you like all his information, his height, status, classification, affiliation, and weapon of choice. Now I always say this, but sadly, still no lightsabers. They do have the kyber crystals. They do sell blades back there. They also have this pretty cool Millennium Falcon print. Look at that. This one retails for $39.99. Looks like they have that lounge fly bag I showed you guys at World of Disney. And they've also got some new Star Wars ears here too. Look at that. These light up. Let's, see, let's try it out. Whoa. Dark side or light side? You choose. <laughs> I like how the lightsabers light up too. That's awesome. These are... Oh, they're lavender. I'm not sure how much that is. But maybe $29.99, $34.99. And then here's another pair of ears. They have these Chewbacca ears here. That is so cool. They're like extra fuzzy too. <laughs> I will say I thought that the quality would have been a little bit better. They feel a little flimsy. I don't know. I, I don't know if they're worth $29.99. So they also got some of the Star Wars Christmas merch here too. They got the spirit jersey with Chewbacca on the front. And then... So Star Wars in the back. And they got the Christmas socks. Chewbacca. Grogu. They got the Dashing Through the Snow t-shirt with the Death Star on there. The Wookiee cookies. They have this Ray ornament. The Grogu one. And they got the hoodie and the leggings. I almost missed this. They got the Grogu sweater. Grogu plush and the stocking. Oh, one thing I want to say about this sweater. So I thought this was for men. It's actually for women. So just a heads up if you're planning on buying the sweater. Looks like they're fully stocked in the Mandalorian helmets. These are, I believe, 120. So this is new. Or newish. This is actually found in the parks by Mondo from Five Fires. <laughs> you can give the gift of Disney Plus. So it's a year for $79.99. And then lastly, they got this new like set in for kids. That snow moon. <laughs> it's got this pocket. It's kind of cool. Uh, $29.99. Sizes go from extra small to an XL. And then they even have like the sweatpants. Star Wars. These are $29.99. All right, guys, that's basically it. You guys are basically caught up with downtown disney you guys are now up to date <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed the video if you guys did please make sure to like comment subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one